Good morning. This is North Carolina Prepper. One of my subs was asking about my cloud server in a shit hit the pan scenario. Basically, this is actually one of the simplest things I did. I went ahead and bought a cloud server. This is a three terabyte one for um, I think it's like 160 bucks at uh, Best Buy. And basically, it's a cloud server. It's the whole thing. Here it is set up and running. And basically, all you have to do is, you can add them, actually, before I get into that, it's got a 3 point, uh, USB 3.0 on the back, so you can add uh, another external drive if you want, or you can just plug in a uh, you know, thumb drive, a bunch of those. But basically, you just turn Wi-Fi on your device. Um, that'll go out. This would be a, a backup power supply here. There's the uh, Wi-Fi router there. And there's a backup battery for the router. Actually, it, um, it goes to the um, the UPS here. I pulled out the little batteries it had when they went bad, and I put in a big worker battery. It is a um, a 50 amp hour gel cell battery to run this, and it'll run this for days. Uh, there was a big power outage here a couple of years ago in a snowstorm, <coughs> and uh, I had my my. Uh, my modem connected to it, uh, an older router, maybe it was this one, I think it was this one, and uh, I ran it in my internet connection for days, and ran the other stuff off the other power, but this is a little contained little power unit I have here, um, but this is basically a simple way to have Wi-Fi when there is no quote-unquote telecommunications in the shit hit the fan scenario. Uh, I will have it, I have a cloud server. If you look at my other video on my Wi-Fi uh, hotspot, that'll extend it over the entire property. Um, I've got backups of this. Uh, two is one. So, I bought another one that's in EMP protected storage. <clears throat> I have a video on the storage with the ammo can. Um, before people, I'm sure people comment that saying it won't work. And it's because they lack it. You know, they lack knowledge. I'm an electrical engineer by trade. I know if I say something the way it is, that's the way it is. But you can all have your own cloud server, have your documents, and you can serve it to your cell phone. In an EMP event, not everything's going to blow up like everybody says. Um, they, they just don't know. Uh, they just don't understand physics. But connected things, yeah, maybe, <clears throat> to the power lines, but this is an EMP video. But you can have your own cloud server for about 160 bucks. Uh, this one, like I said, is 3 terabyte, but it, it's a very simple thing. That's that's how I'm going to do a cloud server. So, I know he was asking about it, so there's my cloud server and my backup. <clears throat> uh, I run for days. I think it takes 2.7 watts, I think is what I, I metered it on. So, how long ever 2.7 watts will go into 50 amp hours, that's how long it'll be before I have to recharge the battery. Assuming there's no solar, or I mean, no light from the solar panels. Um, you, can, you can run this off the of Harbor Freight solar panel if you wanted to. But there he is. That's um, that's it. That's the uh, shit hit the fan cloud server for your document servings or whatever. So there you go. Uh, please rate, subscribe. Have a great day. Thanks.